What's going on, everybody? James Largo, the Cyclochack, the Cyclochack.com, Cyclochack on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, all those other good social media sites. Uh, we are here to do a shipment and inventory walkthrough. Uh, got a very large 35 box shipment in. Uh, coincidental enough, it's only part of the shipment. Uh, the other one will probably be postponed till after Mother's Day with all the flower shipping. Uh, it's risky and my breeder doesn't want to ship some more this week, so we'll see. Uh, I added a nice wild-caught Exochromus Anagenes to the front tank. Uh, I did get one or two others, but they are already spoken for. Uh, lots of nice goodies coloring up in this tank. Coingi's looking real good. Uh, my Rostratus always looks very nice. Uh, lots of goodies. Uh, my Champs is always a crowd favorite. My Wild Caught. And then I also have the Champs Chroma Spiralinkus in here. Starting to color very nicely. Anyway, let's get to what you guys want to see. The new fish. Uh, we got a bunch more uh, F1 Du Boisies in. Uh, very nice two inch. Lots of nice spotting. Still have a couple of the nice big males as well. Uh, let's see. Lots and lots of uh, nice healthy clown loaches. Have a few of the yellow and German rams left. Uh, these won't last long. I know they won't. Some have already sold on the website because I've updated it already. Uh, these are wild caught Lincecromus acuticeps. Uh, I will be keeping the four females, but there is, uh, I believe, eight males. Uh, one or two have already been snagged off the website. Uh, so if you're looking for those, uh, a rare, rare predator hat. Well, not really much of a predator. These are one of the more mellow predators, but uh, a hap that a lot of people are looking for and is hard to find. Uh, wild caught Lincecromus set males. Have a few Pundamilla near eyes remaining as well as a few Macoby Island Nairi eyes. Uh, here's one of the big beautiful wild caught blue phantom placos. Uh, some Garamis, uh, let's see, Zebra Loaches. Down here we got some more uh, Firefin Compressiceps in. Uh, also got some Gelidiochromus malariae in multiple sizes, as well as uh, F1 Nasada Tigers. Uh, that's a Featherfin, Firefin Comps. I had a lot of people asking for more of those. Uh, a few of the hognose cats left. I believe there's another uh, wild blue phantom in here. Uh, a couple of my super reds. And the Kanzu loaches. Uh, four inch plus black ghost knives. Some fancy black moor and calico Ryukin goldfish. Uh, Copatochromus azurius. Uh, have a nice four inch in Benji. Uh, a really nice four inch albino dragon blood that is facing the wrong way. Uh, Rosaline sharks, Odessa and cherry barbs. Here is the other wild caught Acuticeps, or not Acuticeps, the Exochromus anagenes spoken for. Uh, the Spotted Congo Puffers. And some Peacock Gudgeons. And some Endlers. One of the Gulper Cats with a very full belly. He ate two fish today. Oh, lots and lots of the in-house bread fryer eyes. Peacock Alley. Lots and lots of beautiful Angara flame tails, both males and females. 
big beautiful monstrous uh, German Reds these got hit hard today already I believe there's only three males left one is already spoken for on a order uh, so if you want some big five inch beautifully colored German Reds still have lots of females as well lots and lots of beautiful red top Lawandas males and females darting all over the place back in stock big beautiful five inch bicolors there's lots of males lots of females I uh, have some dragon bloods and blue dragon bloods including a monster blue dragon blood this five inch blue is very nice some other dragon bloods big beautiful Ethelwany peacocks both males and females four inch flavescence uh, males uh, three inch females gleaming sunshines have a Chalumba remaining as well as some nice malaria Chidunga rocks oh green face Seleucides lots of males lots of females lots and lots of big beautiful Kobu Regals albino eureka reds males and females this guy's looking mighty nice down here uh, blue neons did not come they're coming on the next shipment I hope uh, lots of females we have OBs in all different sizes uh, skittles OBs some other OBs uh, some locally bred OBs I got OBs, oh plenty. Midnight Who series. Some very nice male midnights. Albino sunshines, big beautiful giant males. Lots of females. Hans Beshi red shoulders, oh plenty. Uh, this Cornelii group is spoken for, trying to get more of those. Lots of new and Benji Regal Blues, five inch plus. This guy is being a terror to the rest of them. Very, very nice. He's even got holding females in here already. Lemon Jakes. Four inch. Not wanting to be on camera. May Landy Sulfur Heads, anywhere from two inch on sex to four inch males. Red Suns. Have a few um, blue orchids remaining. Have some more of these coming as well. These are fresh out of the grow out tubs. Uh, F1 Buchachromis heterotaneus. Uh, I have about 40 of them, but I pulled four or five of them out. Uh, I wanted to see if they would color up a little better in the tanks. Uh, it's been a couple of days, so we'll see. If anybody's interested in those, I have about 40 of them. Uh, email me at jlargo20 at gmail.com. Otter Points. 
Big, nice, beautiful males, two inch unsexed, in-house bred, uh, and I do have some females. Big, beautiful Eureka Reds. Back in stock are the Kate McClear Jakes. Four and a half to five inch males and four inch females. And I have uh, three albino strawberries at about the three and a quarter to three and a half inch range. Say hello, Mr. Robert Valentine. Hello. That was exciting. <laughs> the Super Reds always breeding like crazy. There's the male there. He's out for a change. L144s, Phoenix. Back in stock, F1, Dimitrochromus Kawingis, five inch males, four and a half inch females. Uh, Red Empress will be coming next week. I have a few of my Super Reds that are showing pretty good color and lots of females. F1 Buchachroma spectabilis, males, females, lots of them. Back in stock again, F1 Malawi eye biters, five inch plus coloring males. Lots of four inch plus females as well, including a few holding females down here underneath. There's another male down there. 5 inch Taiwan Reefs, lots of 3.5 to 4.5 inch females as well, very nice Taiwan Reefs. Still have a bunch, uh, quite a few of these wild caught uh, Chilotilapia Uchilis with nice big old chunky Botox lips. Uh, if you like the big lip fish, these are the fish for you. Monstrous, beautiful redfin borley eyes. These guys are every bit of six inch, probably bigger. Very nice, large male Venustus at six inch. Uh, some five inch Mylochromus anthromimus. And I believe I have a few uh, VC10s left, but I believe they're both female. There's two of them. Then some unsexed Venustis. More eye blue dolphins. Lots of three, three and a quarter to three and a half to four inch males. The always beautiful Copetochromus quadrimaculatus. Males, females. Very, very beautiful fish. Back in stock, living stone eyes, five to six inch. Protomelis hertes. And there are some wild caught Buchachromus notitanias in here. Uh, five inch and six inch wild caught Buchos. There's a couple of really dominant living stone eyes looking very nice in here. Placidochromus Jalo Reefs, four to five inch males. I have a wild caught Taiwan Reef remaining, and the others in here are two and a half to three inch F1 Fireline Melodos. This is my group for Mr. Adam C. that I have grown out the Mylochromus Spilisticus Macola Reef. Uh, keeping this as a group, I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to because he lost his now and I'd like to keep these going. Up here are F1 Lethernop red caps. Uh, I can see a few males showing pretty good color already. Uh, I have listed them as unsexed though. They're two and a half to three inch. 
I uh, hope you caught that one. There is a definite male showing that I saw when I first came up here. There's one right there. Autopharynx ovatus, both males and females. Nice, big, five inch plus, beautiful males. Five inch to six inch tangerine tigers. Four and a half to five inch females as well. I still have this one wild caught spilling out of Tanzania. Coloring up very, very, very nicely. And I have a ton of females that are F1. They're not wild caught. The only the male is wild caught, but all of these females are, and I have a bunch of unsexed, which I believe are females left. I threw all the males in the tub. So if anybody's looking to breed spilling out as Tanzania, we have lots of females and the wild caught male. Bodzulus, nice big five to six inch males and females at four to five inch. Lots and lots of beautiful Xerox lithobates. Big five inch males, some bigger. I also have some three and a half to four inch Phenochalus Tanzania star sapphires in here. And we have a bunch of female Xerox. I have some three inch and four inch male Xerox that are bred in house, as well as all the two and a half to three inch females you're seeing. Uh, here's one of the bigger uh, four inch males, the five inch plus males. Look at that blaze. There's another four inch male here. One of the phenos. Malawi barracudas. Lots and lots of barracudas, including this big monster one. Friar eye, electric blue friar eye, five inch males. Really, really nice five inch males. And white knights. Both males and females on both. Wild caught Aristochromus Christi eyes. I have four inch females and five and six inch males in the wild caught Malawi hawks. F1 Taylor Elethronaut Prior Brutalis getting bigger. Was able to get some more 4 inch F1 Champsochromus Corellius Malawi Trouts. And I have a Champsochromus Spiralinkus F1 remaining. One is spoken for. Uh, I can do my best to sex the trouts, but they're very difficult even at this 4 inch size. Uh, so they are listed as unsexed. F1 Buchachromus notitanias at 5 inch and a nice 6 inch wild caught Buchachromus notitania male and a 5.5 to 6 inch wild caught Buchachromus spectabilis. There's one of the F1s. Down here are F2 Buchachromus spectabilis. More of these are at 4 inch. drop per gallon. Lethernot Mubazis looking very very nice. Some bleaker eyes and also Cynodonus Epturus and some Cynodonus I think it's pronounced Decturus. I have some nice big ones probably four and a half five inch I'm not, I don't believe I listed these on the website. If anybody's interested, you can email me at jlargo20 at gmail.com. Albino Taiwan Reefs and Deepwater Haps. Back in stock, both 5 inch plus, as well as 4 inch females on both. Uh, both are very, very nice.
Redhead Tapajal Geophagus, have about five or six of these remaining. These are very, very nice. Angelfish, have a couple of the wild caught demon geos left, as well as the turquoise severums. These are wild caught Copatochromus species Chidunga Chingata yellowfin. Uh, I have about 40 of these. Some of them are starting to show the nice blue in the body. Have these at a really good price for wild caughts. Oh, lots of goodies up here. Green Severums, Blood Parrots, Thread Finicaras. I have a uh, wild black line pike remaining. And some red hooks and some other tin foil barbs and stuff that locals have brought. Those are not listed on the website. If anybody would like them, you can email me. Uh, local sale tank. Uh, electric blue Akaras have gotten much bigger. I have one Tiger Oscar remaining and some, uh, I think three of the Electric Blue Texas. Very, very nice. And D Wave Fire Haps. Uh, I have added this to the website. Uh, two inch assorted male tanks. I have like three tanks full of them from our breeding stock now. Uh, the way it will work is if you order a certain number of haps and peacocks, we will pick the nicest looking uh, colored variety of what we have available and send them to you. Uh, I will, we will not be letting people cherry pick specific ones uh, as they may not be available. Uh, we will send the nicest assortment of peacocks and haps that we have available in the two inch males. Uh, we also did it with the Ambunas and you'll see why here in a second. Uh, got some more also four inch F1 Buchachromus Leptura yellows. Uh, again, these are hard to sex with certainty at this size still. Uh, so they are listed as unsexed. And I also still have uh, five or six of these wild caught Rostratus in here, females. My ever popular Mylochromus Latastriga long nose breeding group. Offspring from them in those two tanks. Uh, rainbows, lots and lots of different kinds. Also, this tank has. Lots and lots of more different kinds of rainbows. These are F1 Malawi Hawks. We have three and a half to four and a half inch Malawi Hawks. Uh, the three and a halfs are listed as unsexed. Four and a halfs are listed as males because I can't pick out males at that size. Uh, your choice. I have probably 90 hawks at between the four inch and four and a half inch range now. Lots and lots of angelfish. Uh, some neons and I have a few discus left and a Chinese algae eater a local brought me. More discus coming. Uh, locally bred red devils on sale locally if anybody would like some I have them at a really good price uh, they are not online but if you would like some email me okay the Mbunas I was able to get a really good deal on three and a half to four inch assorted Mbunas uh, so I did list them just like the peacocks and haps at two different sizes uh, for assorted Mbunas. Uh, there's all sorts of different kinds. Uh, we got over a hundred of them in. A lot of Pseudotrophius and different kinds of nice Mbunas. Uh, there's six tanks full of them. Including like albino erratus and red zebras and uh, you know Philiborn eyes and Kenya eyes and red zebras and Obi red zebras and just like tons and tons of variety. 
Uh, lots and lots of good size Ambunas. So we have listed them the same way we did the Peacocks and Haps online. And then we have some that are just listed uh, at the way they are and you can order specific ones. But if you'd like to get a nice mix of Ambunas at a good price for good size, uh, choose the assorted Ambunas and we will send a nice variety of these different Ambunas that you're seeing. Alrighty folks, that's it for this inventory walkthrough. As always, thanks for watching. Be good to each other. Just remember these are just stupid fish videos. And God bless.